um, uh, there's not a specific actor or a director that I want to work with, but I definitely want to do um, some great character roles. And um, for me, the directors like Anurag Kashyap or Humi or Hansel Mehta or my ultimate favorite, which is Sanjay Leela Bansali. So uh, that would be a dream come true if I did a film with him. Uh, so they're directors from various, uh, various uh, cinemas and uh, I want to do it all. I want, uh, you know, besides the glamorous role that everybody uh, aspires to uh, act out, I want to do the de glamorous stuff. I want uh, to be challenged as an actor. So when I'm here, for me, it's about acting. Uh, it's not about wanting to do, uh, you know, a certain type of role. Uh, I need to be challenged as an actor. So 10 years down the line when I see myself, even if I do one or two or three films, maybe it will just be one or two or three films for me. But I want to look back and say, I actually pushed myself when I did that. Uh, no, that has taken a back seat for now. Um, and I've entered a new phase of my life, which I'm enjoying just now, with all my heart. So I want to give it 100%. You know, the thing is, uh, he is very calm as a co-star. He's just, uh, he's so composed and so calm and uh, he gives his vibe that it doesn't matter, you can fumble as many times as you want, I'm here, just do your job. So he doesn't, he doesn't even need to say these things. It's just uh, his presence and the aura uh, that you feel very comfortable immediately. I do a lot. <laughs> like, so um, right now I, uh, I do a lot of Pilates, okay. uh, I train and uh, I do cardio an hour every day. Uh, I make sure that I eat right. I don't believe in diets. So I don't believe in following a particular diet, but I, I firmly believe in eating every two hours and I tend to stay away from processed foods. So I, I eat any food, but it needs to be uh, uh, available. Uh, in a short time, I didn't go through any training process, but as I think it's very important because when I did do a workshop, uh, it takes you back and uh, it's sort of you need to draw from certain emotions in life. So then you need to you need to have a, you need to go through a workshop because let's say they want you to be happy. Uh, okay, so they say, Malusha, this scene you have to be happy. I can do it. I can, uh, but I'll be faking it unless I am able to go back to an emotion at a time in life when I was really happy and relive that moment. So to be able to relive that moment, uh, I need to meditate. I need to learn how to bring that moment back into my present moment. Um, so that's the difference between somebody who's acting and someone who's actually feeling the emotion and bringing it to the character. Uh, there is Irfan Khan, Deepika uh, really uh, She's one of my favorites and I think she's very, very hard working. So uh, she's somebody I admire in actors. Ranveer Singh has over the, over the course of the year grown on, I think, all of us. Uh, and uh, Otherwise, like I said, your is something I really want to see myself working on. I think I'll, um, the, the slate is very clean right now, uh, so I don't know where I uh, fit in. I will find my uh, little uh, cushy corner in space, but I'm not looking to compete with anyone. I think there's enough of, uh, there's enough for everyone, uh, and each of us have a different uh, path. I'm so raw to this uh, entire uh, experience that I'm having, that I'm enjoying it, but yes, like you said, there is a little pressure to you know uh, up it how does one up it <laughs> how does one up the game from here yeah. but already exactly yeah so if i can be both things at one and we have many hats we are not just one thing we are we can be 10 things at the same time and yeah. give equally to 10 to 10 areas at time <laughs> fortunately um, i've got very strong uh, strong uh, kids i think they take from me so it doesn't matter what life throws your way, you have to deal with it and acceptance is a big part of it. So instead of fighting and saying why is this happening to me in my life and why, you know, I had a dream and it shouldn't have ended up like this. Instead of fighting that, you accept it and say, you know, this is my journey and there is a reason why things happen. So it's something I also inculcate in, uh, in my children. So, they will also grow up to be strong individuals who will have a career and run a house at the same time. Um, I don't get angry so soon. I don't get angry so easily. It, you, I don't. I take life as it comes. So um, it's very difficult to get me angry I think but most things that annoy me are people who are fake. 
So fake people, I get to surround myself with people who I feel are fake. Uh, so I think there are very, very small steps that each of us take. And one of the most important steps is, like I said, acceptance. And uh, once that falls into place, uh, everything else sort of also uh, tends to fall into place. And uh, women today can have a career and they can also run a house and they can also look after their children and they can do all of this single-handedly and it is being done more and more so uh, in our country to inspire uh, uh, some women at least uh, in, in small small ways and uh, let's see where this journey takes me and if I'm able to inspire them on a larger level. but I should write it's not uh, I don't write but perhaps I might write a book someday about my journey and uh, it would uh, it would be a book on again pos positivity and uh, uh, facing anything that life throws your way so I think maybe a perspective of what I've gone through and what life has thrown at me and how you overcome it